So this is a super simple exercise to practice with your dog that'll make a world of difference in getting the behavior that you wanna see them do more of and to help ensure or potentially get them out of the habit of being reliant on waiting to see the treat until they do the behavior. Your first step is to choose a marker signal that you'd like to use while training with your dog. And in this video, I am clicking. Um, sometimes I also use a verbal marker such as the word yes. For dogs who are hard at hearing, you can use a visual cue such as a thumbs up. Your marker signal will always be followed by something your dog enjoys. This makes it more likely that whatever behavior your dog was doing in the moment that they perceived their marker signal is going to happen more often in the future. And this is because they're developing a history of that behavior resulting in things that they really like. Now, once you've chosen which marker signal you're going to use and you have some tasty treats on you that your dog really enjoys, you are going to mark the moment that your hand touches your stomach. You're then going to reach for the treat and give it to your dog and start the process over again. This helps us practice the habit of not reaching for the treat until after our dog has done the behavior.